Hello everyone, I have been struggling with rigging ears for a long time. So I wanted to make a beginner friendly tutorial on how to make ears. Today I'll be using cat ears as an example. But you can apply this method to other ears as well. So it's okay if you have like a static ear layer. It doesn't matter. Um, basically it's supposed to be separated like this this artist has done a really good job this is the first layer the ear fur and the back layer okay so i have the parameter set up so what you need is rear rotation air physics one two three and two ear furs um, for my blinking, I set it as tree physics blinking and ear fur blinking if it's an extra you one. Okay, so the first step is you would like to highlight all of your ears and make it a wealth deformer, name it rotation. So mostly people would use the rotation here, but I don't really like it. So what I would do is I go I like um make this into three keys, go to the left, modeling, temporary deform, rotation, set the thing, the anchor here, whatever, as long as it's in the bottom, make it the middle here, and then you move to you know, now you do the same thing, modeling, temporary, rotation, same area, go to the bottom here, move up, okay, now you have your up down thingy, then go to, I like this tree again, like physics 1 and 2, so this physics 1 and 2 is like a huge movement, but the third physics is like a little teeth movement so what i like to do is i highlight i make like three keys for this two first go to the left of the first one and bezier type click this i like to go smooth tree or smooth all so i go for smooth tree most of the time if it doesn't look nice i just go smooth all so what you want to do is you want to make this thing like go down so you drag this down, drag this down, drag this down, drag this down and then you go to the right go here, go here, go here, go here okay and now you want to go reset back to default in the on the second part this one air physics 2 go to the left You'll be only touching this, 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 and then up, up, up. Just want to do some adjustments, okay? And now you do versus synthesize corners. So you synthesize this too, and then you want to make this extended interpolation make this eclipse okay it just looks better and then you want to make the third parameter like a web deformer maybe tree and you just want to move the tip of the ears on the right side on one move up and then this down okay you're done now for the ear fur, it's up to you, but I like making it like this. This is your reference, so I like to use this brush, my favorite brush, make it big, hold B, and then you like scuttle using your mouse, like move right, or you just can increase it here. So what I like to do is I like to make it big, like expand it, and then shrink it, and then I like to make it go down, and then go up, and then 
and then you synthesize it again. Okay, save. So now you want to go to physics settings, click add, air rotation, right side, and just copy my settings. Where is it? Okay, so it will be a brown uh, white angle. It's my brows. And then you have these physics settings to 10, 0 0.77, 0 0.92, 0 0.92. And then you want to grab your ear rotation right here. And then make sure your preview settings of cursor tracking right here. Scroll all the way down. Up this, 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 this setup. So mine is left mouse button Y and this is X. So you want to look up and then click increase output. There we go. And now you want to press prototype ear Linux. And then the same thing. You copy this. Um, this. Um, hold on. Okay, so make sure the ear rotation angle is set on 69 or 70. Angle X and Y set up 40, 30. This is my ear physics here. So you want to add ear physics 1, 2, 3. Click up, deal, increase output. Okay, if it's too much, like the number is too much, decrease it. Now it looks good, right? And now, lastly, you want to add the ear fur. And we set up to your ear physics, the first one. Right here. And this is the physics settings here. 10, 8, 1, 9, 1, put 8, 9. Get the gist of it. And then you add the ear fur. If you don't like how much it expands, you can go back and like switch it or you can like reflect it. See? Now, we work on the ear blink. So you want to have the blink on top of the ear physics. So you make a rock, you click this, physics 1, 2, make a rock deformer, you need blink. Okay, I like to make my blink a um, blend shape. So what you can do is make ear blink blend shape then it's negative one one. So I'll use my six existing parameters. Okay. So the same thing as the ear physics. Move down, 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 down. Up, 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 up. Okay, default. On the second part, down, 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 up, up, up. A little bit more change. Down, down, down. Okay. Now that's it. Down. And up. Okay. So for the ear fur blink, same thing. I need to name this. Fur react. Go to click this, block the former, or blink. And this is up to you as well. I like to it go down. Okay, brush again here. Down, up, in, out. Make sure your ear for blink is um is also blend shape like the blinking part is always blend shape okay but once you're done go back to physics settings okay i already have my blinking set up so my name is ear for ear blink here make sure l i l open and i r open angle is set to 50. my angle is set to 20 20. you can copy this Okay, so for example, it's like this, right? It's something that much. Increase. You wait. 
bam. It is too much, but you can just decrease. It shouldn't be over 800. So same goes for the ear for blink. It has the same thing. Just like do this, duplicate. And then you set it as the ear for physics here. Right here. And wait. Increase. Too much decrease. Okay, that should work. And then if your ears are well separated like this one, you can do the ear flip. So what you want to do is to create a new parameter, name it ear flip, left or right, minus right, blend shape, negative one and one. So I use a lot of the one brush too. Okay, so you want to go here. Make sure you're like, do your own mesh generator. Mine is like this. Mine is like auto mesh. Like the mesh is really good here. You can just use the heavy. So mine is like heavy, okay? So you want to make um a key here. So what I did is this one is go back. So you want to extend the fur here. Make this big. Okay, mine is set to 633. Go through here. It's okay. This one as well. Like this. You wanna like have the imagination of like it flipping back and forth. And then for the ear fur, ear fur, go back. Okay, if it looks bad, it's like keep fixing it always trials and error and now for the right side for the right side here on the positive one this one since it's already down this one goes up so up 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 this one down up this one increases okay you can go down more this one please and like drag this. I just pray it looks good. And you can do more fixes, just like zoom in and see whatever makes some fixing. Still. But overall, it should look good. Go to physics again. Type ear flip. Poppy my physics. Okay, make sure this input, so if you're doing the right side, make this like the right side ear rotation and right side ear physics, the first one. 31, 20, 10. Okay, this is the physics setting. So you want to do, do this. Ear flip. Yep, down, left, right. Increase. And there you go. Okay, 